Mbappe. Oh my goodness. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the new SPC Lionel Messi PSG card today with a five-star skill move upgrade. Oh, they didn't change his work rates. Let's go because the medium low on Messi works so well in the middle positions, the side positions, it genuinely doesn't matter. So I'm so happy that they did not change that work rate because it's just the medium low for him. It just suits him so well, right? So guys, five foot seven, medium low work rates, left footed, five star skill moves, four star weak foot. The skill moves is huge for this card, okay? In-game player traits, he has the finesse shot trait. He has the outside foot shot trait. He has the one club player trait. Yeah, I don't know about that one. Yeah, I mean, that one's going to be a little bit of a change there, especially with the new team. But hey, it is what it is. Uh, obviously, with this card, guys, uh, we don't need to give him a chemistry style. We don't need to give him an engine chemistry style or anything like that uh, because everything is essentially perfect on this card, right? So his pace is at a 99. Shooting is at a 99. Passing is basically at a 99. And then his dribbling is at a 99. So the card should essentially have absolutely no problems. The only thing that Messi has is obviously his height being at a five foot seven, but you guys already know that his dribbling before was monstrous. One of the best dribblers in the game because it works so well with his messy body type, right? The messy body type, big deal for a card like this that has 99 dribbling for everything because it's just really, really good close control dribbling. It works well for those finesse shots, right? So very important that... You know, everything is essentially perfect on the card because <laughs> he looks cracked. Um, defensive stats, he's at 88 for heading accuracy, which, okay, cool, you know. But it's the physical that he even has as well that's really, really cool to work with, with 99 strength, 99 for stamina, and then 94 for jumping, right? So, I mean, the card looks phenomenal. I think he's, like, listen, I've already used the Summer Stars card, and I like using him in any of the attacking positions, but where he benefits the most is in that cam position. He's so freaking good there, right? So let's see how this card plays in game, man. So we're going to be using our typical 4-2-3-1. If you guys haven't checked out the tactic video for this formation, we do have that over on the YouTube channel. What we're going to do here is we're just going to switch some players here and there just for the sake of the review. So I'll put Paredes as a CDM. And then we're going to put Amavi as the center back here. So yeah, just going to switch out Mbappe over there. And use Di Maria as the fullback for now. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, the only instruction we're going to have for Messi is come back in defense. Perfectly fine for him because he has 99 stamina. And um, yeah, we'll basically take it from there, man. Hopefully this card is a beast. I mean, I'm pretty sure he will be. But I'm excited to try him out. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Nah, this card is going to be... Oh, ho, ho, ho. what a freaking goal. Wow. You know what's funny, man, is that his... Uh, I think it was a Summer Stars promo, right? He scored a very similar goal to me with the way that he hit the long shot was disgusting. And that was just phenomenal, man. Dude, his finesse shots are so crisp, man. I just wanted to pass it back because I want to show you guys how good he is at hitting them, man. Everything just works perfectly for him to hit it the way that he does, dude. Oh, that's a low percentage strike too, eh? You can just see how crisp his dribbles just come off, eh? Super, super nice. Oh, yeah. Like, listen, man. We hit him with the instant shield. If you get him on his strong foot, especially on that near pulse angle from that quick fake shot, no emphasis on it. He's just going to bang it, bro. Hmm, give me some of that defensive work, too. I like it. Mm, love it. See how he moves into the empty space right here. Oh, 
That's a good one. That's a good one. The way that the ball settled there, that should be a good strong, uh, weak foot strike. Especially with his shooting stats. You have to be super careful because those little quick cuts allows him to get into those finesse shot opportunities way easier, man. It's just... It's crazy. Shot cancel is still effective, man. It just makes the player overcommit just a little bit more in that defensive area for you to, you know, create that space for you. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. That angle is terrible for that roulette. <laughs> uh, give me that angled run, though. A little pass off. Oh. Oh. Okay. I'll take the penalty there. I got like a small little jewel right there, and it actually worked out for him. His penalty is 99, right? 96! I mean, it's not far off the truth, to be fair. Ah, I gotta go for a chip. To the left side? Oh, he saved it! <laughs> nah, could you imagine if I hit that from there? Maybe it's because of the pressure, you know? Dude, from a bounce? From a bounce. He did that from a bounce, bro. The, the, it wasn't even coming off with the right skill moves, and he still got it from a bounce. I had to like compensate a little bit, you know? Oh my goodness, man. Oh, being able to do that scoop turn. <laughs> Excuse me, from that movement, that's going to be nasty, man. Nah, nah, nah. Yo, you got to relax, Messi. Your long shots, you got to chill. They come off too good. I'm sorry. You got to relax, my guy. Nice and calm. Nice and calm. Adapts quickly in those situations. I could have gone for the right foot there, but I felt like he was going to read that immediately. Nah, dude, his dribbling is just... Like, I could just control that left stick so well with him, man. It's too much. Dude. It's the it's those crazy, like, last-second touches, you know? Like, oh. Okay, guys, so we're going to go ahead and play him in the striker position this time. Honestly, like... You can play him in any of the attacking positions, especially nowadays, man, with the way that the game is kind of formatted. Uh, Neymar, love using him in the cam spot. I think for this team, I think this makes the most sense with Lionel Messi up top. Um, yeah, we'll just have him on comeback defense. Just want to see like, how he moves with the medium low. I'm very happy that they kept medium low on him because I like it personally for how he performs with his dribbles, the way he positions himself for those finesse shots. So uh, the card is brilliant so far, but I just want to see what he's like up top. Oh man, he already positioned himself perfectly for that left foot strike. Well, Derek, the goalkeepers have to be spot on right from the first whistle. He was absolutely brilliant there. Dude, you see his shooting from a distance? He does this curve thing, man. His summer star scored a goal literally because he did that. Coming up for you is a rival's game to look forward to. I certainly can't wait for this one, Lee. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers might be a chance here. Wow, you know what's funny? I came off of a really bad dribble there too. You see how there was like this emphasis behind it? That emphasis causes less consistency, but he still scored. And obviously, the attacking AI, brilliant in that situation, adapts well to how I'm dribbling with my other attacking players. Like, this is... This is fun. <laughs> this is fun.
Listen, I did that for fun and that was still accurate. With power too. I gotta learn how to do the uh, long distance strikes. Oh, that's, oh, you see, emphasis, right? So because he did the emphasis there, less consistency. If he came off of a sharp touch, easy goal. FIFA mechanics, you know, you gotta, you gotta kind of feel it out a little bit. And look at that adapt. Oh, I love it. Oh, I should have gone on the fake shot on the inside or the outside. That was bad. Oh, no. You know what was crazy, though, man? How many times have you seen me dribble with him? And it's like it's like he does this small touch to just avoid the defender completely, bro. I'm telling you, they always just go past the ball, man. <laughs> Every pass hitting its target. Paredes. You see what I'm saying? The guy does a challenge, he just does his sharp touch to get away from the challenge. Oh, I need to, I need to do this. I need to. Over the go over the defender? Ah. Round two. Oh no, the guy out of nowhere. Oh, register the ball roll, EA. Come on, man. Crazy dribbles, though. Just a regular power strike, man. Regular power strike on his weak foot there. Crazy, man. Crazy, bro. This card is crazy. The dribbles, the way they come off. The weak foot being a four-star, genuinely, like, it just doesn't matter, bro. It doesn't matter. This card is ridiculous, man. Beauty. Does the animation, too, on his left foot, eh? Love that. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay, guys, so final verdict on the footies PSG Messi card. I mean, guys, there's not really much to say. Uh, the card is absolutely filthy, in my opinion. It's crazy how, like, because they've boosted his stats so much, he just does certain things that are so insane, man. Like, his dribbles, he does, like, crazy last-second touches. Crazy ones that, like... Even when the defender's put in a challenge, he just still maintains the ball. He has this crazy sticky thing to him when it comes to his dribbling. Just sticks to his foot so well. Finesse shots come off like crazy. Long shots, dude, he does this like insane curve to his long shot. His summer star scored a banger for me the last time when I tried him. And this card still does the exact same thing. He gets crazy links to Neymar, Mbappe, players like Marquinhos because of the PSG links. Full meta criteria stuff here. Um, I mean, guys, this card is unbelievable, man. There's really not much to say about it. You know, he's just a disgusting card. The only thing that you're really going to notice and more when the game plays not to par is obviously height when, you know, defenders are doing certain challenges against him. But even in it, his dribbling is going to compensate so well and just move across the pitch like a monster. I, you know me, man, I love using him in the cam spot, but you can genuinely use this card in any of the attacking positions. It genuinely doesn't matter. He is a phenomenal card to use. I mean, guys, a card that has shooting slats like that, outside foot shot traits, finesse shot traits, perfect at everything, like, disgusting, man. Absolutely disgusting. If you guys want to do the SBC, 
I think I think I saw on Twitch when I was watching Nick stream that he's like what 1.5. Wow, you guys are <laughs> you guys are crazy with that stuff. I think he's worth it, man. I think he's so so disgusting as an SBC and as a player in game. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this video. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.